Blood as a glucose molecule flowing through the side of soul when the cell needs some ATP for energy. We start a metabolic breakdown like colonies, but first we need to invest and burn ATP. We take glucose, hexokinase, and phosphorylate to get glucose 6-phosphate. Phosphoglucose homoracial rearranges to give the sugar. We call fructose phosphate. Invest another ATP to phosphorylate the sugar using the enzyme they call phosphofructokinase. It's the hope of my thoughts and dreams that you don't forget the name of this regulatory protein. Like all it says, it'll keep us alive and get glucose. Enzymes that will help metabolize the process, a series of reactions. They will give us an ADH and some adenine C triphosphate. Like all it says, it'll keep us alive and get glucose. Enzymes that will help metabolize the process, a series of reactions. They will give us an ADH and some adenine C triphosphate. We phosphorylated. Now we got fructose one six bisphosphate. Now we'll bring in some alkylase. It'll cleave the sugar into two, the both three carbon compounds, but we'll focus on just one. Glycer aldehyde, three phosphate, oxidabatrios phosphate hydrogenase. Now I have our two NADH and one three bisphosphoglycerate. In the last reaction, we get some inorganic phosphate, giving another phosphate group for us to work with. Now we begin to get some ATP using phosphoglycerokinase with ADP. Substrate level, phosphorylation. 2 ATP with another common compound. Yeah, 3 phosphoglycerate. As you now approach glycolysis last stage. Glycolysis, it'll keep us alive and get glucose. Enzymes that will help metabolize the process. A series of reactions. They will give us an ADH and some adenine citrate phosphate. Glycolysis, it'll keep us alive and get glucose. Enzymes that will help metabolize the process. A series of reactions. They will give us an ADH and some adenine citrate phosphate. Phosphoglycerimutase. It's the enzyme that turns the phosphoglycerate into two phosphoglycerate. Now we we'll take the enzyme enolase and create the common fossil enolpyruvate. It's a compound with very high potential energy enough to create some more ATP. With pyruvate kinase and some ADP, you got pyruvate, a compound that is phosphate free. Now let's review glycolysis, the process by which we live our lives with. The breakdown, some glucose we get to an adhd for adenosine triphosphate. Yeah, this wraps over. Go memorizing a call this until your head hurts. As for me, I'll bid you goodbye. This is a process I'll remember till the day that I die.